Welcome to Marine Max Rogers. My name is Max Cavanaugh, and today I have the pleasure of showing you this beautiful 2023 Nautique G23 right behind me. And like we do on all of our boats, we're starting off on the exterior. Looking up at the front, I will point out it has these beautifully integrated daytime running lights and docking lights right up front. They look sharp. This boat has the haze gray exterior, haze gray hull bottom. It looks really good. You have the black Chromax decals. As we come back here, we look up to the tower. You have the nice black tower that matches this black accent color on the hull side. On the tower, there'll be a few things that I'll point out like the strapless board racks, the tower speakers, and the bimini top that this boat has optioned. As we work our way to the rear, or to the stern of the boat. You'll notice right away, this boat comes with a platform cover. Keep the sea deck nice and clean. Now underneath, Nautique has their NSS, their Nautique surf system. It's a plate that deploys about two and a half, three inches outside to create that wake for surfing. Now, you have your NCRS, which is the Nautique configurable running surface. And that is what's gonna help you know, adjust the pitch of the boat to also help create that surf wave or wakeboard wave. You have your standard Nautique surf pipe, underwater lights, and the Nautique integrated steering assist, which works great in tight situations around docks, even loading your boat onto a trailer or putting your boat onto your lift. That was the exterior. Let's take a peek at the interior. All right, we're inside this beautiful G23. And like I point out on every G23 or every Nautique is the beautiful walkways they have. This one has the gray sea deck throughout the entire boat, which looks really good. We open up these hatches in the rear and you'll notice this is all storage. All the ballast is subfloor, which leaves room in your storage compartments for your things, which is great. Close these up. You'll notice this beautiful theme of the haze gray interior with the jet black true weave accent here. You'll notice like the jet black accent piping on the seats, which looks really sharp. And as we step in here, I'll point out the strapless board racks, making it really easy to clamp your wake surf boards or your wake boards into the racks. They swivel in and swivel out, which is again, a nice feature. The JL audio speakers up on top of the tower and then the nice bimini. Right now, this bimini is in its closed position. It does open up to the right and to the left. Gives you lots of shade. Now, this G23 has a wake view bench here. Pop this up. Now you have this nice little bench here to comfortably view your wake surfer or your wake boarder or maybe you're pulling a tuber and you just want to get a better view of the action so this is a nice thing that they have in the g23 and the g25 and the g21 now where this seat was stored there's a little shallow compartment for storage underneath there too that slides right back down into place you can let it just go do its thing underneath the seats as i lift them up all the seats are on supported hinges, which is very nice. I don't have to physically pick up a seat and move it somewhere. Inside, it's all lined with C-Deck, finished off very nicely. You have a few more benches that lift up, little backrests on both the starboard and port side, which is really nice. More versatility in this G23. As we step forward some more, we'll take a look at the passenger side. We can lift this passenger seat up and there's more storage underneath here. You have a trash can and you have a subwoofer in there as well. The passenger seat is heated. And how do I know that? There's actually a passenger um, heater button right in here. So you can press that, this seat warms up. The captain's chair is also heated, so that will warm up as well. You can stay out for quite some time on the water, be comfortable, especially if you're, on, you're out on a brisk morning and you know, you're surfing, you're wakeboarding, you can come into the boat, warm up on one of the seats. Now, glove box, it's recessed, so it's easy visibility for the driver to see through the windshield 
and out into the distance, which is nice. Great space in here for your phones, your wallets, keys maybe. You have a JL Audio head unit, some USB chargers, some 12 volt plugins, all in there. Close that up. You'll notice the speakers right by the windshield. This is the wavefront speaker. So this is gonna bounce sound off of the windshield and back in towards the cockpit area. More premium sound experience. Looking at the helm, you'll notice that the helm is beautifully crafted. You have a nice captain's chair that's race car inspired with this cutout here, which is really nice for the driver to be able to turn and talk to people here in the cockpit. You have great bolstering through the midsection, through your thighs as well. This seat does come with a bolster, so if you need to sit up a little bit higher, you certainly can do that. At the helm, you'll also notice this nice big oversized armrest throttle in the right position. You have your encoded rotary dial right here, which acts as a mouse on the Link Pan Array screen. Don't forget the Link Pan Array screen is also fully touchscreen. You have hot keys around your dial here, and that's what Nautique feels you will use most often, and that's why they put those there. Wireless phone charger, a few cup holders. The one thing I'll point out, all of the cup holders have a ring around it that lights up because this bow is optioned with the enhanced courtesy lighting package. So those light up to whatever color you choose, pink, purple, green, um, yellow, or blue. I mean, it's anything. It's really cool really cool feature to have in this boat and kind of customize when you're on the water for a better experience. As we move forward here, a couple things too, I'll point out one more time with the helm, nice little tray up here, little phone holder for your iPhone or whatever phone you do have. There's garbage can access in the walkthrough. You do have a optional pocket door, slide out air dam, blocks off the wind, close your windshield, turn on your heaters and again maybe you're out on a brisk morning you come back from surfing or wakeboarding get in the boat you're kind of cold lock the wind off turn your heaters on stay nice and warm this does have dedicated storage so it slides right back in up in the bow very spacious especially on the g's they're very wide you have armrests on each side it does come with a bow filler cushion that you can switch over to the C deck side as you see right now. So this can also be switched back over to the cushion side and it's a full lounging pad up here. You have two cup holders on each side, two grab handles, two speakers up in the front. Very well appointed boat. Armrests fold back down. And there we have it. This is the 2023 Nautic G23. It's located here at our Marine Max Rogers location. If you have any questions, come stop by. Feel free to give us a call. We'd be glad to help you out. Thank you.